All right, so we got some news. I didn't even know that TNT actually posted on Reddit. So I just saw this page. Probably talk about that in a bit. I also want to do some general shit talking about this idea that uh, they appreciate the transparency. Got a definition here. <laughs> but first things first. All right, I hate the stupid news page here, but... What I want to talk about is what we could just have. <clears throat> like, all this time, if I could have one wish in Neopets, it would just be to have pulls. They have pulls that are that work in your guild, so I can promise you there's some way they could do this. I'm not sure how or what they could do, but I assume it's definitely possible. <clears throat> Alright, just imagine a day where you log in and you go, oh, there's a pull, take it. It takes you five minutes. How often should we change the prize pool? This is for the daily quest, obviously. Okay, every one month, two months, three, six. All right. Should the prize pool options have an R180, retired items? All right, let's look at those quickly. All right, here we are at 180s. Let's see, how many are worth over a million? Oh, to zero, got that wrong. Basically, should these various items not be allowed? Obviously, people are going to make their vote. Is what it is. Pretty cool. All right. Back to our neat little poll. All right. Ooh, what did I do here? Anyways. Should we add an item that allows you to reroll your weekly reward once per day? This would not restart your progress. So if you're in day three out of seven... Can you reroll the prize and it doesn't go back to zero out of seven? You just keep going. Yes, no. I'm like, okay. If question three passes, you'd make a threshold where if you get like 80% to a yes, no, would pass, whatever. All right. If question three passes, how should this item be earned? Okay. Is it an NC buyable? Is it just a daily prize pool reward, one in 50 chance? All right. A random event for <clears throat> subscribe only. Members, a new reward on the level 5 dice of Dice Saru, which is the final one where the jackpot is. Or a reward from Talia. 1 in 200. Alright. Another cool question. If question 3 passes, should this item be tradable? Interesting. Obviously, it gets kind of fucky if it's not actually an NC item, but it is what it is. Alright. Then, hey, let's talk about the AC Cup. Interesting. <clears throat> Should the limit of maximum points earned per day be lowered? Currently, some fake number. Four hours of stupid soccer game. Okay, yes, because that's dog shit. It, like, the only people getting that gold trophy are bots, so. But I'll bet you about that when the AC Cup happens. All right. If yes passes, what should the new limit be? All right, so like a fifth, 40%, 60 whatever. Make a vote. All right, then. Good question here. Should playing the current Flash games during the AC Cup earn you Ultra Cup points at 1 MP, 1 AC Cup? Yes, no. That would solve a lot of problems for most people. All right. <clears throat> what sort of prizes would you like to see in the AC Cup prize pool? Neg, stamps, paintbrushes, expensive shit. Pretty cool. All right. Which of the following would you like to see most? New species, paintbrush, a fairy that gives a new quest? NCUC has been able to use the NC items you paid for. <laughs> and then some money hungry grab here. Unlimited pet slots. Alright, this wouldn't happen, but they could run other pull questions like this. What are your thoughts about the ambassador program? Positive. Generally positive, negative, very negative. What even is that? Alright, then you could have even more fun one. Do you believe Dominic is a greedy owner who actively allows bots free range on Neopetal consequences? Options are yes, 100%, also yes, I'm just happy there's no crypto bullshit in the game. Yet. I missed typo there. Like, that shit we could just have in the game where, like, they just gotta blame the users. We're like, hey, you guys voted, you wanted this? Easy peasy. You know how easy it would be to make people happy just having polls? It's like shit. Then the players could, like... Having the players able to communicate and talk and be like, hey guys, actually right here, this would be a cool prize pool, Calvin and Hobbes comics, thought that was pretty funny. 
But having the players interact, discuss, you get you get way more traction. You'll see way more people talking about it. It's just, it would do so much for the game. But they just refuse to do anything good. All right. Now I'm going to start complaining pretty heavily because, you know, it is what it is. All right. Hello, Neopians. Taking into account recent feedback, we have made updates to the quest log price pool plans. Rotations will be postponed until July 1st. <clears throat> Oh, June and July. That's a long time. <laughs> I misread that. That's many weeks. Okay. That's May. And then right to there. That's crazy. All right. Moving forward, we are planning to rotate the prizes every two months. See, was that so hard to do? Was that so hard to do, guys? So first things first, let's talk about like the elephant in the room. Why are they leaking and discussing these price pool items with the ambassadors? Why is there a select eight people who even get to even talk about this bullshit? It's one of those very frustrating things in life. Because the ambassadors have proven over time they're just selfish pricks who like like they're like at their peak functioning, they're people who are like, hey, I'm going to get mine and hopefully I can find a way where I can, I can heavily benefit and the players get a little something like when they had players who were doing the art or like, Hey, like I not want to be able to sell art while being an ambassador about the game. <laughs> it's like one of those things where like it wasn't allowable whatsoever at all. And then all of a sudden ambassador wants it, it's there. Obviously the whole sap clusterfuck. And then they just, just factually happen just under the rug you know i got shit on dominic a bunch here and i always do it's just one of those stupid things where like the part where it gets leaked by an ambassador for some reason i think that like what the price pool obviously i don't read the news site because this is just uh, like this is bad for 1999 but granted your computer has had like a different resolution but down here somewhere okay Heads up, the price pool for the quest logs are about to get an update. So be sure to complete your quest. Like, be sure, like, if, if it's a seven-day period, you didn't get a good price till day six, you just couldn't complete this. What a dog shit program for that, too, but. So why did they walk it back? Because they saw the economy going fuego. Like, shit just went out of hand. Some coconuts exploded like that. This guy's trying to fit, like, shit was selling for, like, 2 million, went up to, like, 70, 80, 90. We talked about it yesterday or the day before that. It's just such ticky-tacky, wonky bullshit. Anytime the ambassadors are involved, you know it's going to be a clusterfuck. It, it just has just shown time after time it has no, it has no value. What value have they brought to the game? The only value that they brought to the game is showcasing how Dominic can't run a fucking website to save his life. Like, I still can't get over that, like, I promise you, I can almost guarantee it, they're counting them changing these gray backgrounds, this gray, the graying, as part of the actual nine month of this event happening. Like, that to them is part of the actual plot. <laughs> And they, like, that plot was so long ago. Actually, I'm, I'm, I'm going to bitch about it even more. Hold on. All right. So this is just, like, the Neopets page since, I think, Dominic era. So, like, in seven months, what have we gotten in the game? Obviously, I didn't. I did a reaction to this a long time ago. But, like, what... Is there actually any content talked about in here? I forget. They had a video of, like, actual Dominic, like, releasing that. Where was that? Starts at 8.20. Anyways, like, what have we gotten in these, like, seven months in the actual game? Like, content-wise. It's absolutely crazy. Like, when you look at the actual game, what has changed in the game? Like, there's, like, no new games. We have less. There's no new areas. There's no new quests. There's no new paintbrushes. There's no new species added, at least yet. There's no new prize pools for things. 
like all we get is like this this is this is the major addition is that we're gonna be literally ai bots in the matrix just clicking over and over again i'm not gonna load my completed page so yeah i just do the ones like this i wish it would show when you actually did the quest because i do such few quests but yeah all right like seven months and what do we have like they didn't change we don't have like a trading post limit from two million up we don't have like a better way to trade and see items premium still sucks ass and they have that recent thing that's a complete joke they can't give a sale on the website but they can cancel four months premium there's still a gazillion bots in the game like morphine potions are going crazy they're like just this is like the thing where like it's almost like the better example is like a chimera where like they try to solve one problem by like patching it but they that ends up making like two two different holes in different places so they get bigger and bigger all right <clears throat> so like overall like this is a relatively a good thing <clears throat> hey every two months we're gonna change it all right cool like that it took them seven months to release this two line two lines that explains so much to player base now you can know after two, after this the two months buy and sell you got this chance to buy it and it's going to go out of rotation so it'll have some stability it won't hit a certain threshold limit because people were going to reinflate it after so you got a pretty good idea <clears throat> pretty cool once again, I don't know why they keep giving ambassadors inside information. Because once a second, they learn that, hey, all the items are going on right now, they're coming off, and it's like, hey, you just buy those, and then you wait for other people to find out, and then they're going to reinflate the fuck out of it. So you just make so much money for what? Just being a dog shit human? Like, it's so crazy. I'll, like, almost every person on Reddit would probably say, hey, like, Hey, we don't like people having inside information. They're just regular players. Like, can we not have that? <laughs> like, hey, should we have people in Congress who are like investing in certain shit and not like doing that? Most, like, the majority of people would say, obviously, it's a bad idea. We don't want people doing fucking lobbying <laughs> who are part of Congress or various parts of your government are like so frustrating. That's your bad system. All right. <clears throat> so, thank you. I appreciate the tra transparency about plans moving forward as well as past items having a chance to show up in the prize pools i think two months sounds like a good happy medium for things to say this is fun thing where i had to look at the word transparency so refers to the quality of being easily seen through or understood without any hidden agendas or secrets the secrets here are why the fuck are the ambassadors who are just bumfuck regular players getting information not released to the public why are that why is there a select elite few people who get this information that can be easily and heavily abused i don't know why they leaked this i think someone like i'm on stop verifying but like if they if they only had like four hours of knowing this you know how much np you could make in four hours of knowing this was going to happen like literally if i had a hundred and hundred million mp i could 10x that in four hours by just knowing that these are gonna be gone these items are going to go from 2 million to 50. I could turn 100 million into a billion like that. Easy peasy. Or 10 into 100. What I want to do for yourself. All right. Keep going. It implies openness, communication, accountability in various contexts. It is essential in productive personal and business relationships. It promotes trust, clarity, and understanding among all parties and players. So this is actually a good example right here. Going forward, these are the rules. Everyone understands this is what's going to happen. We're keeping these. But the part where for eight months they didn't do this, for eight months we were all held in the dark. How long will this be the prize pool? How long do I have to get it? People are scared. They're panic buying, panic selling, panic inflating. And all it takes is just some common sense. Hey, every two months, whatever, every three months where they want to pick, in out liquidly split that's fine okay that's gonna cause so much more stability and we can just kick out the ambassadors just out don't need you here you're not helping you you 
You have no value to the actual game you're bringing. It's so dumb. All right. All right, examples. An individual speaks their mind clearly and honestly without resorting to manipulation or hidden agendas. Hidden agendas, exactly. People making NP. Obviously, like, this is what a lot of their business at TNT is manipulation. With, like, the NCUCs having a limited time only. Like, that you're being manipulated. We're like, hey, it's only here for two months. If you don't buy it now, you can't get it. You, so you, therefore you feel pressure. Hey, if I don't get it now, I can't get it. But meanwhile, they're going to re-release every fucking known NC item capsule to the game. <laughs> and then give you all these retired items. Like, it, it's its own little controversy there. But, like, so much of this game is just about having instant information, manipulation, knowing this, not knowing that. Like, how many players didn't even know about this drama and were selling these prize pools for... Two, three million, and meanwhile they were worth like at the time fifty or thirty or twenty, given a, the last forty-eight hours. Admitting mistakes when someone takes responsibility for their actions, acknowledges their errors, and does not shift the blame. Once again, like Dominic's talked about transparency for such a long time, but the part where like the like the ambassador thing, he knows about it, he saw it, he's like, don't give a fuck. Like TNT, Alice clearly being accused of like getting trillions of NP. Knows about it, ignores it, doesn't give a fuck. Price, price people are price gouges, inflators, resell that kind of shit. Hey, we're not gonna police that or control that. Get fucked. All right, like bots, real trading, this, it's rapid as fuck. Don't care. Tony's gone. Get fucked. Like scripts, buying items automatically from the sh various shops. Don't care. Whatever. I'm just so curious what it would take for them to scrap the ambassador program. Because I have no idea. Like, to me, it's like... Like, 50% neutral, don't give a shit, don't really care about it, it's irrelevant. And then half the time I hear about it, it's just like them doing really shady shit. Being caught doing it. And then, like, the game creator just being like, whatever. Like, these people get special privileges and they get things you don't, but get fucked, we don't care. All right, that's a, that's, a, that's a pretty fair comment. They don't update the news page on weekends. They did it on the message boards. What? 26th at 7 a.m. Is that in the U.S.? Wow. Slorg, all right. I've never in my life even, like, where is this thing? Uh. <clears throat> it's not even like space up oh, well. Oh, that's annoying. What's this gonna do? Be a picture, I'm guessing. They can do all this, but they can't give me a goddamn poll, eh? Social... Uh, I don't care about this stuff. Available in Canada. <laughs> like, the part where they can't get permission to play in the United States. Quite funny. Can you play it online? I hate element. Like, to be honest, if this was on Steam, I'd probably play it for sure. Like, I, I'd play it just to, to play it to get it done to show you guys. But the part where they want you to have other shit, like, what even is this stuff? Like, I feel like I'm in my like grade eleven computer programming class. I'm making some dog shit HTML fucking website screen. <laughs> like, <laughs> okay. Uh, like, it's, it's such a cluster of a high school. The part where, like, it's uh, just super annoying. All right. Anyways, don't you dare steal my comment. All right. This is great news. Like, this is just, like, this is just common sense. Hey, going forward, two months, the items could come back, could not come back. We're keeping code zones in. P.S. For me personally. 
please add in map pieces. Pick one map, I don't care which one, preferably space or regular. Like this is how low the bar is that what people would do in like grade five is like being just heralded as like the next best thing. I wish too that when they swap out the prize pools, they could put in some new tasks like read a book or play with your plushie or go fishing. Like once again, that doesn't, that adds no enjoyment to me as a player. Read a book. Ooh. Ooh. Like, I guess that's a money dump per se, but this adds to me no enjoyment to the game. Um. The customized pet, yeah, like, my, I don't really do quests unless they're going to give me a good daily reward. I don't do weeklies. But, like, my customization page wouldn't load for, like, 20 minutes. It was, like, 11 o'clock. I'm like, well, I guess I don't get that prize anymore. Glad I had faith in TNT and didn't panic buy. Another dumb fucking con. Like, they're the ones who were making the change. They're like, hey, six and a half months for these prizes, and then you have three weeks to get these. Like, they're the ones who had control start to, like, like, like they drove the car into your car and hit you. <laughs> and you're like, they're 100% at fault. Great engagement by the community. And thank you for the transparency, two months, like, <sighs> he had faith in Neopets to fuck it up and then have, like, apparently have enough people get mad. They're like, oh, maybe, maybe, maybe like, them having 25 weeks to get those prizes and they only have three for the new ones when they had the old prize pools and you had the fucking 100k reward in there was a bad idea. <clears throat> Thank you for listening. Rip to anyone who shall email for the coconut stamps. Fuck them. I sold my coconut for 80 million because I was certain because of how much outrage the community was having. Like, where is the outrage? Like, I can't be fucked to read, like, the Neocord. But, yeah. It felt like, the thing is, like, we can get this change, but we can't have bots getting banned, eh? Alright, that's great. Why would they need to give you... <clears throat> Alright, keep going. Great news, clear and concise. This, this is how, how low the bar is. It's just like a common sense like, hey, maybe kids shouldn't bring knives to school. And you're like, wow, really? That's, that is really a breathtaking thought. That's Switchblades are bad. Kids shouldn't have them in middle school? Wow. Wow. Let's keep the eggs. When people sign their own name, it's a little, ugh. This is going to be super weird if you're not thinking this, but, all right. It's heartening that... It's kind of like, imagine if someone took a shit in the backseat of your vehicle, and you're like, hey, you took a shit in my vehicle, and they're like, yeah, what's up, bro? You're like... Would you mind going to clean it up? And you're like, oh, okay, I guess I'll do that. That's that's fair. <laughs> and you're just like, oh man, just yeah, like the part where like this is the first time they're like they're I've seen them on Reddit just directly doing something despite me bitching. Like the part where they don't have like instant Q and A, a person designed to do this. I've been talking about for a long time. We are truly in an age where TNT is trying to be on the same page. <laughs> it's like people think like they're on m Mars and like it takes 11 months to get information to message back. Like what? The game provider is supposed to be giving you good engagement and content that keeps you excited and wants you to keep playing. Like,
This is like someone who's like, my grandpa has a phone and he can text me now. <laughs> it's like, oh, this is great. I still think three months is the ideal sweet spot. All right. Thank you, TNT. Like, I probably had little to do with TNT Luna. Like, we did, like, to be honest, we, like, we jerk about the word transparency at close that page already, but, like, we should be, like, Dominic should be held to account. Someone should ask, hey, the last prize pool was six months, six and a half, and then you've had a new prize pool, and it was supposed to be about a three period. Run me through that thought process and how you did that. You had the six months, and then you were like, hey, let's rotate this out after four weeks. Okay? And then what changed? We want to know what changed to make you, like, the... Because something had to have happened internally there. And I wonder what that is. Like, that's the important question. How did you fuck up so bad? Like, where did the train fall off the tracks here? Like, like we see a crime scene. We want to know how it happened. Like... The house burnt down. We know it, that's obviously a tragedy and it's super sad and whatever. But how did the fire start? Is it an arson? Was it a negligent kid doing something? Did someone have a lighter and they kept it? Like what happened? Like knowing what happened is super important to a clusterfuck like this. Because the last clusterfuck of this proportion was the fairy festival. Let's go look at that for a second. So I found the page where it's supposed to be at, but because we live in a revision, a revisionist history timeline of things, they no longer have the little thing here that showed the old thing where R100s had the most amount of prize things. But it's still so funny to me that R98s, R100s were worth less than an R90. <laughs> And also, don't forget the clusterfuck when the, all these robot pet pets inflated up to like fucking a million. They didn't do dog shit to solve any problem with that. It's just kind of how sad how people forget these dog shit things they did and just were like, yeah, here's what it is. I'm also kind of sad they took off that page explaining like the old, the proposed items. Yeah, it's just gone. Just want to double check here. Yeah, no, it's gone. It's just crazy. Like, like I guess that's not important. Like, I guess you got to cover for fucking TNT. All right. Anyways. Anything else for exciting? <clears throat> The part where people will just chop this up to success and not like TNT, like basically fucking up the game, poor management, poor discussion, poor transparency. Like the part where like they can do 90, it's like, this is basically like, hey, I, like you're like dating someone, like they went to some frat party and then like they did whatever questionable things you don't know about and then... You're like, hey, like, heard you did that. Like, and they're like, yeah, I'm sorry. And you're like, oh, they, okay, it's fine. It's said they're sorry. No, no big deal. Whatever happened, happened. Sorry. Okay. It's like, no. <laughs> like, what happened? Why? Like, it's just so hard to trust TNT. It's like, oh, like, what are they going to fuck up this time? And it's not as if this was, like, a remotely controversial split. Like, it was such a dog shit idea. We're going to go from literally 26 weeks of having the same prize pool to four. Duh, like <laughs> Someone was like, that's a good idea. So like the heaviest transparency or the heaviest conspiracy theorist belief is that people were unhappy with those certain new items out of the prize pool and wanted them to be taken out. We're like... Okay, guys, you got the cat, you got the candy chan stamp, you got an avatar, but hey, we got we got to just cool this down. All my cool shit as an elite player or or an older, retired, or rich or person who buys MP, 
we can't have all these fucking dumb plebs getting shit. Let's call let's 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 calm it all down. Let's give less rewards. Let's give out paintbrushes over the other shit I don't care about. Alright. <clears throat> Obviously, the most heavily conspiracy theorist idea would be that the, mo the ambassadors were like, this is not good. Change it up. We know what they want. They want this dog shit. We keep this. That would be the heaviest. But they got pressure to do that. But it is what it is. <clears throat> this is not encouraging. They did something dumb. And then they obviously re-rolled it back. Obviously, let's heavily fuck the economy too, but that's like that is what it is. <sighs> oh, geez, negative comment. The uproar from people was hilarious. It's interesting how people think they're entitled to flaming coconuts, wands of the dark fairy. <clears throat> Can we do one month instead? That was literally what they were trying to do. All right, let's look at TNT Luna because I didn't even know she posted on here. So let's go to her submitted. Oh shit. She's been on here for four months. TNT work group chat. Corporate needs you define the difference between these two pictures of the same picture. That's the whole thing. Was that us bitching about it when they're just recycling all art and charging you for it? Okay. Maintenance. Update regarding premium. Like, you could respond to these currently still. A previous glitch allowed users to still have access to premium despite. <clears throat> and users who cancel will. At the end. Yeah. This was because they fucked up with the four month. Like, when they, when they took out the four month subscription or three month, whatever it was, this fucked up how it. It's fucked up something in the programming or coding, so it is what it is. Neopets is hiring, yeah. That's good for you guys. Ooh, I clicked it before. Let's take a look at that. I'm almost positive someone posted that in my Discord. Yeah, in BC, when you post a job online, now you have to post, like, the actual salary. But now what they do is they go, uh, we'll say, like, McDonald's employee. And then it'll be, like, pay scale. It'll be, like, 35000 a year to 150000 a year. And it'll just say, like, depends on experience. And then it's, like, it's just a work away around the law. It's interesting. Please make it legal. <laughs> I mean, it's it's like you can do it, but you'll get in trouble for it. Yeah, all right. I can kind of see this is just there's no real interaction here. The it's the AMA. I can't wait for the new plot. Well. Keep fucking waiting, bro. Um, I'm not even sure he's even doing the AMA next time. Neopass now available. <laughs> this was another bad implementation. Uh, from our access testers. This is just like not good. Like, I'm going to link all my shit to my fucking Neopets account. I'm going to list my Facebook, my this, my YouTube, my Instagram, my TikTok. I'm going to get my bank account. <laughs> all my alts together so when one gets banned, they all get banned together. This is funny. 
when you see something like this, it's like, oh, all this cool thing. You'd be like, oh, this is pretty cool. But every time I see people talk about Neopass, this is how I think about it. It's like, oh, like, in theory, it looks good. Then it's just a complete clusterfuck. <laughs> and I, I never, I get, like, I just cannot ever not laugh when I see that front foot just be like a little, little fucking stick. <laughs> like, that front leg always gets me. <laughs> it's like, it's, oh, shit. Neopass updates. Hello, Neopians and Neopets. Like, the part where these get, these get no upvotes is why I never see them. We have added. <laughs> Alright. A fellow believer right here. Post this shit on the fucking the actual website. Like, let's know what's going on. Like, this is the problem with, like, the current day. It's like new story to something stupid and then like it's a complete fuck up in TNT and then, like you'll hear like a retraction like eight days later at like a Monday at 3 a.m. that knows that we're gonna read annual promotion fact FAQ I'm not a subscriber and this is nowhere near a good enough incentive oh Oh, I am hot and bothered. Oh, like knowing I'm just like, I probably, like my opinions are probably held by like maybe 10% of the people who play Neopets every day or like still play. Oh, this is the part where like this got such a low, this is hilarious to me. Nowhere near a good enough incentive to make, convince me to drop money on it. Specifically, I'm not interested in how Ents is drip-fed over time. It feels like it's alienated existing users while not even providing enough incentive to attract us. Oh, like... <laughs> you'd almost think that was me who posted that, but there's not enough swearing for that to be me. <laughs> or not enough, like, PS fuck Dominic in this dog shit site he decides to not update. Yep, it's fake money to buy virtual pixels, which I'm not against that per se, but just I don't think it should have cost you fucking eight bucks a pop rolled art. And I think you get dog shit for premium. So, like, I'm not a full on hater to that extent, guys. I just think you should fucking give you a good fucking product for your fucking price you're paying. Like, no one here wants to spend fucking $18 for a fucking six piece fucking McNuggets at McDonald's for a fucking medium fry and a medium Coke. But yeah, like, Back in high school, I didn't mind paying for a 10-piece nugget meal supersized for like $9.27. I was down for that. That was good. Two folks chipping five bucks. That's a good day right there for you guys. Fuck filet of fish Fridays. That, that sucked. I always hated Fridays because of that. Also, the part where like the people who had bought an annual subscription... Just before this, they get nothing. You get absolutely nothing. They didn't say, hey guys, we got a thing coming down the pipeline in like a week or a month from now. That's going to be good for your, like, much as I hate also Blizzard now because they just fuck up most games. I guess they own by Microsoft now. But, like, they would do six month and 12 month subscription things where, like, if you bought a, a one year pass, you get, like, a dumb fucking mount in the game. But, like, every, like, 12 months, they re-release the same fucking bullshit annual scam pass. Like, you know, hey, I bought this, but then a day after your sub ends, if you rebuy another year, it's the same fucking ticket you go on again. Like, <sighs> questions. I have, ooh, way more upvotes. I've been a year subscriber for years. Why should I continue to be one? Because you're, uh, if you were dumb enough to buy it before, if you're like, if you're dumb enough to pick the, the play slots <laughs> and lose money, like we don't need to have a follow up. Uh, I play a game where I statistically I'm gonna lose forever across time. It's a losing process, guys. Uh, why is the focus on new players giving money and not appreciating the players who are already giving money? Because you're already locked in, like. If you're dumb enough to have done this, they're not trying to get you because you're going to keep paying. 
This person probably has 20 fucking pets. And probably has 10, 15 NCUCs. Like, they know you're addicted. Like, they, they got that good good and you want that yum yum. <laughs> like, I love when people, like, answer their own questions. Like, this is this, this is all very hypothetical because TNT doesn't give a shit. And that's just not how Dominic... Like, Dominic has been like, hey, I'm only here for money, guys. I don't care about the game. I'm here to make money. And they're like, why doesn't the game appreciate me as a loyal player? Like, they're... Like, the last six months has been them fucking players who played 10, 15 years, stored up, traded, restocked, got rich, got a one item worth like $100 million. Now it's like, if you had $100 million, you know what? You know what? You don't even deserve an opinion because you're part of the problem, man. It's like, Jesus Christ, save me. They've been fucking you left, right, and center. And now you're like, you know what? Like. I'd appreciate some lube, and they're like, no, you're going to take what you get because this has been the plan for the past 10 years. Like, all right. No, no. Get on all fours. Here it comes. <laughs> like, just getting piped by TNT. All right. Is there no concern currently? Current year subscribers will cancel. Why should I continue to give my money to a company who doesn't care about... Like... I love when people are so dumb that like they answer their own question and they're like, oh, like I'm, I'm the fool. Oh, like, oh, like the game should be providing me with enjoyment and engaging content. It's not upon me to go bitch wide and find some own weird side quests. Like maybe I'll go collect all Talia's things for a gallery. Feedback. Genuinely, this feels like a final straw in terms of spending money. You've already been, you've already given them, like, like, they've milked your titties, bro. Like, they got it. It is what it is. <clears throat> I regularly spend thousands buying Neocash. I buy most of the, like, gaming. <laughs> this sucker's going nowhere, guys. This guy isn't, there's no way, bro. This, this is not, this is not it. This is like when a person has, like, a, a room in their house dedicated to, like, whether anime or manga or like whatever big titty anime pillow things. It's like if you have your own room dedicated to this kind of shit, you're not going nowhere, baby. Uh, I would be just as angry if it was a free candidate currently. We appreciate your continued support. <clears throat> it should be addition also announcing after the poll... Also announced it's after the poll for the AMA feels like a coward's move because I know Dom doesn't care about the players. Oh, you didn't realize that when they were fucking the economy the past nine months, doing dog shit updates, no new content, no new one. Like, what? <laughs> I do want to investigate this person a little bit further. I don't want to, you know, dick ride too hard here, but I'm, I, I want to see how this story is going to end. <clears throat> I know something is serious when you openly talk about it. This is a known player? 108,000 karma, bro. Interesting. I'm kind of sad now. I don't know who this person is. But in terms of like, I don't understand the context. All right. Thank you. This was really frustrating to wake up to. I don't know what it is, but for some reason, this is just really getting to me. I've been beating my own ass cheeks about this. Like, what's going to be the final shot for players to realize, like, this game is just constantly not doing anything to keep it fun, engaging, people interested. Like, just uh, log in and customize your pet for day 174. Oh, you didn't get a good weekly, so you didn't get a good weekly fucking thing. There's nothing new about it. Oh yeah, we had this new reward where like if you have five alts, you can just go get five cool negs and make 25 million MP. Easy peasy. Oh, you don't have five alts? Well, get fucked, I guess. I try to be understanding of TNT's issues they have. No, no. So I try to find ways to rationalize their bad decisions across six months. This would have been so easy for them to do. It was an active decision to leave a group of players out. This has literally been the past nine months. 
this is this is a very strange thing to re like, this is this is someone who's so deep in like this is like when you when you know someone like <clears throat> almost everyone has those friends they have in life or like either they were dating or married but like they're always on and off and there's always like like they're either like they're super like touchy lovey dovey or like they're always mad ignoring spiteful hateful there's it's all it's always one of two things either they're super yes or super like low and down and that there's no normal rational like hey like maybe like maybe yelling at someone in a walmart parking lot and threatening to like stab them is a bad idea it's like yeah that's obviously a thing it's just so strange yeah no like <laughs> don't don't apologize for being honest like you know what like if you whine you whine you complain you complain if you're giving a compliment just just send it i've been very loyal to neopets over the past years the thing i think some companies are forgetting yeah well this is how it's been the past nine months like yeah like it's just this is the thing where a lot of people like i've made in videos over the past nine months bitching about tnt is they don't give a fuck until they get the short end of the stick. If they don't lose 100 million MP on a new weekly prize pool or a different thing released for an event, eh, get fucked. That's your money. But eventually, at some point, something personal hits them and they go, "I don't like that. Like that actually affects my life. I like I feel like shit now. Like I don't. That's <clears throat> like what on Discord I've talked to people who like they just bought that eight bit morphing potion for like. 25 or 35 million and they, they were only worth like 50 million so they lost half of their fucking net worth fucking like six weeks after they bought this potion and it's like they're like yeah like i literally spent probably 30 40 50 hours if not more making an mp and now it's gone like like i i try to make money i'm like i just remember how i, I could have an extra whole bunch more and like you just you just can't break out of that cycle. It's like you you get scammed by the like getting scammed by the game creators sucks. Like because that's what it basically is. By the way, I know I'm I'm going up and down here on this person, but like, truth be told, like it. It's nice to see someone be relatively like, honest and genuine, knowing like most of the time you're supposed to like lick ass and kiss, you know, kiss the boot. Or the brown nose, like just put your nose right in their ass so they feel tickle. I know I'm coming off as whiny or dramatic. If people can't relate to this, then that, that's like, wait with that later. I cannot express how much Neopets has meant to me over the years and how much I relied in addition to therapy, touching grass. Like, this is like, hey guys. I said this and it's not K like this is n I'm not K it's, it's, it's like sometimes like I've had a few videos where like I'm super fucking pissed off then like four days later I'm like like I'm not as mad anymore but this is a follow-up where it's like I'm not like this is this, this is probably going to be li a lingering concern <clears throat> I didn't realize how thin I was wearing until this announcement. That's the thing. Burnout's a real thing. And it's like, it's like, obviously you can be in pleasurable hobbies or even worse. Like at some point you're just like, you wake up and you're like, I don't got, I got nothing to give. This gas tank's been on E and you're just waiting for a chance. <clears throat> yeah. I think a lot of people have had this for like, just waiting for Like you're just like, you just, you know, you're just on the brink and like, if someone says something or has any anything you perceive as an attack, all right, you're about to, you're about to get a tongue lashing. You're about to get a serious conversation. <laughs> this is literally one of my biggest annoyances in life. Businesses offer extra special deals to new customers and just yep. Yeah. Because like Dominic will tell you, standard regulatory business practices your dipshit is going to spend money you're not going to leave right <clears throat> like i said i people already know that i bitch about the four months and I, that's why i didn't resubscribe 
I think you hit the nail on the head of a long time user. I've been beating this fucking drum for like I was on the bandwagon where I was like cool new items for new players it's super fun enjoyment then you're like well bots are getting away with so much and then the players that I, I know how to work super hard at the are getting fucked I'm like this isn't sustainable for a long time I made a video I got a lot of dislikes and I like, probably lost subscribers too but yeah like it's unsustainable like they're just showcasing you time after time after time they're not going to reward good loyal regular players they want the magic word is resurgence <clears throat> when you buy something unless you can tell some dog shit investor the game's expanding they don't care their job is to grow like as a personal like also like under like dominic would trade you and a hundred people like you in a fucking heartbeat for the food club botter. He would rather have the FC botter make money, bought the fuck out of the game, and ruin the game economy than have a hundred players like Nebula Mammal. That's just the reality of the situation. Like if you can't see that and if you if you're gonna gloss over or just not see that, they don't they don't give a fuck about loyal players. That's not the company it's about anymore. It's never really been about since Dominic. Uh, I should have. I mean, I could have. I. It's the thing where I thought I'd be grandfathered into this old thing, but <clears throat> nope. I thought I just fucked up. That I like when I when I I had to cancel my premium twice for it to actually go through. And then even then, I still kind of had it for that extra like short time, which I made a lot of MP. That was pretty cool. I'm currently paying four months. Moving one account to gain that. Do I know what? I don't know. I, I can't be fucking read that poorly worded thing. Thanks for speaking on this cat. Mm, Katrina? Or just like they have cats. Been playing since January and I've already sunk hundreds into the site. Interesting. This is an interesting, like... The bit about we appreciate your continued support. I mean, if you don't have premium, you're not a continued supporter of the game. Yeah, I see. Oh, man. I can't wait to hear some bullshit excuse from Dominic on Wednesday, the 29th. It, it's such a poor mechanic. Like, it's just... The thing is, like, they don't make a lot of money off premium. They make it up people buy it and see and... That kind of, yeah. It, premium suck for a long time. All right. I will no longer give them my business. I think people have become complacent. Well, yeah, like if predation is a real thing. Like they just, they know you're not going to leave, so they're going to keep upcharging you. I spend thousands on this site. Oof. Why should we port? Because you like, at a certain point, it's like a sunken fast, a sunken cost fallacy where you invested so much time and money that you can just you can't give it up you can't not keep going too much of your life revolves around this and you put too much time effort in it to just give it up <clears throat> yep yeah see forcing they forced me to stop fucking subscribing that's what happened right here so yes, they're trying to get people out of that four-year grandfather thing in, because I'm going to guess there's something going on with that still, in terms of... Alright, this is where I get a, a decision. Where... <clears throat> she's part of the actual dev fucking team. And she's sorry that longtime players are expressing... This, this doesn't even make fucking sense. I'm sorry that longtime players are expressing. They're not expressing anything. 
Oh, I wish I could fucking dample this person. You made an update that clearly bypasses rewarding players who have been the most loyal to the game. I'm sorry that players are expressing. They don't. Uh, if you would value them and give them the respect and rewards for being loyal, they would not be shitting on you. What a dumb fucking comment. Oh, that's annoying. I'm so sorry that longtime players are expressing they don't feel appreciated. Not like, I see the clear flaw in that we've offered nothing to people who already have the one year, who have bought it for 10 years. Oh, great. This is the fucking Joe Biden thing here. As one myself before joining TNT, I can really understand your frustration. But want to emphasize that we are listening. What the fuck are you talking about? What do you mean you're listening? <sighs> this is like, we can't even like, either this person just is like, this is just an AI response. This person just doesn't understand common sense. <clears throat> like, So, I'm sorry that we fucked you by not including you into the reward program despite you paying for a subscription for probably 5-10 years spending well over 4 figures, $1,000. We want to emphasize the word listening. If you were fucking listening and gave a fuck about them, you wouldn't have excluded them. What a dumb fucking backwards fucking double speak language clusterfuck this is. The premium being announced after the AMA was purely coincidental. No, yeah, like the part where like, okay, we have the AMA and then the day after we're like, you know what guys, let's have a new thing. Oh my goodness. But we have added a segment for Dom to address both the premium promotion edition. Uh, like, like, hey, we, excluded you you're sad we're listening and don't worry Dom will have some bullshit to fucking sell you right here wow I don't know who we're listening to but it doesn't seem to be us <laughs> this, this should be I don't think I have a print screen of that like this is such a this this would this is why they don't post on reddit because this is such a bad fucking comment I'm sorry that longtime players are expressing they don't feel appreciated. Like, like you need to get permission to express not feeling appreciated when a clear, a clear implementation didn't reward loyal players who've been playing for more. Like, we want new players to get the cool new shit, and you're old fucking Tom. Like, we don't care about you. Get the fuck out of here. We want, we want new. That's like an office space where like they have these guys who worked for 10, 15 years and they're like, well, we want to have new recruits who are 20, 25 years old who are going to work a little harder and they're just like fresh faces. We want to have a young active work group. Get fucked. This is like, this is a chef's kit. This is crazy. But yeah, like obviously like lo and behold, like, hey, like. We'll put a dumb little band-aid and we're like, don't worry guys, we're listening. We're gonna we're thinking about a way to do this. I sorry, I'm just this is a really bad comment. Ooh, they responded. This is getting way too long and I apologize, but I'm having a great time. I gotta leave at like 520. Ooh, we gotta hurry. I'll be honest and say I'm struggling with replying to you because I feel so frustrated right now. Uh Oh shit. That's my timer. I was like to look at the time. Uh let's just say there's no way to respond to your dumb fucking comment without me saying some things that I can't take back in the future. The part where like long they are like this is where just like maybe this is like their third language is English, but I'm so sorry that players are expressing why would you just say I'm like, just say hey, I want to apologize that 
a loyal player like you doesn't feel appreciated, I'm going to look into ways of making sure that we appreciate you as long-term players. Like, hey, you matter. I care about you. We want to have you guys know you're appreciated with some sort of in-game appreciation. But that's not what you fucking wrote. That is not, like... I am sad that this is the response they got. I feel so frustrated right now, but I don't want it to seem... <clears throat> All I want to say is that I really mean it when I say Neopets has. Uh, I cannot express how much time, thousands of dollars I have given this website. I've spent. All right. Well, I mean, six months. That's a little much, but. To, to be relatively honest, like the part where you're willing to spend that much money than care about like 2000 NC, which is like 20 bucks, that probably isn't the hill to die on, but it's a hill to die on where like you're being ignored. This is like where you had like a best friend for 40 years and you like, you're like, hey, come to my birthday party, and then like they just don't respond to your text, and then like you see them posting shit like something else when they just ignored you. Upcoming does nothing to make me feel better. I assume it'll be everyone. Exactly. You'll, you'll get a fucking little star or a trophy because you complained about it. And they're like, well, we sure fucked that up. Unless Dominic says in the AMA that he is doing something equitable. I would just say he's doing something. I like the word equitable there. I mean, like... There's a lot of... There's a lot of messiness to this person's comment. Like, you've given them $6,000 in a month? That's... It's strange trying to navigate this, because, like... Saying you understand the frustration and are listening means nothing if long-term players aren't being respected. Like... I'm just so curious how this is a specific issue. Like, it's... Because we've had a lot of bad updates. For the first time, it doesn't feel worth it to give money to Neopets. I mean, I'm not sure when it did. Anyways, I hope you read this and pass it. So what happens at that time? This person is probably from somewhere like the UK somewhere. Man, this is a crazy fucking comment poll. Yeah, so like at this point, I'm just having a good time and I'm just recording a video at the same like this is this is, I've had more fun in this actual post in the past twenty minutes than I've probably had in Neopest in the past two months. Oh. oh Jesus, she's still responding? Oh my goodness. Whew, this is dear diary. Like this is a jackpot. Most, if if not all, are already locked in. I completely understand and empathize with this sentiment, and we do sincerely wish we had the capacity to bring back a premium promotion sooner. Unfortunately, due to limitations, we can no longer ship to the United States, Canada, Mexico, Uruguay, or Paraguay, or Chile, or anywhere it has a time zone. Oh, man, like... Th this is like, hey, and go fuck yourself. Find a stick, go stick it to some muddy water, and just jam it up your ass. Because that's what I mean, like, thanks... Thanks so much for taking the time to share your honest feedback. If you don't have the three working brain cells to consider how fucking pissed off and how dumb this was, so I'll include them. Fuck me. Like this, like this is so beyond dumb that it's, it's just on par with what TNT would do. Like, Dominic would have read some fucking crypto bullshit fucking, like, article written by some other fucking person that I wouldn't probably like writing a company. 
And I'm like, all right, like, how do we, how do we try to tell people, like, people are buying the game so they can sell it to some dumb fucking magazine to say, we have new players, join the game. I don't understand why it's being given to one month for subscribers. I was about to say why it's not. It literally take no effect to adjust. We know they can give away free NC, guys, because they, they did it for fucking Christmas two years ago in 2022, and they gave it away for the anniversary sometime around September last year. They can give you free fucking NC, guys. It's possible. Ooh, negative comments. It's just so funny. Like, like this is what it takes. This is what... Interesting. So interesting. What about people who pay monthly technically be paid more over time? The only reason I don't buy annually is that you can be frozen. Exactly. Like, I don't have the faith in Neopets to not fuck me for 11 months. Not a Neopets user, but I got locked out of my accounts even though I missed the... When I read that, I'll think it's Game Boy Color. <laughs> This literally works for month subscribers. At least read the info before you write yourself up. Only if you want to subscribe on an annual basis. I know too many people who pay for an for annual. They get frozen for using a VPN. 60 bucks down the drain. Uh, I didn't realize you were asking for perks for being month to month. <laughs> Sharp Rick, eh? Yeah, this guy watched Rick and Morty for sure. All right. That's not a perk. A perk is something the plan offers. We could talk about perks or incentives or... Alright. Great job leaving out existing members. <laughs> oh, it's so funny seeing people who are like not dick riding TNT. This is like, this is such like a... I'm not out alone fighting battles against like a tree like Rock Lee. Kicking the thing because I can't do any cool fucking ninjutsu. Shit. <clears throat> What a pointless post acting like we can't read. <laughs> I mean, they gave us a chance to actually post it and she could respond to it. So, hey, like, she's doing a lot of things wrong, but this, this really wasn't the exact problem. Whichever hype decided, this clearly hates both the existing fan base and the social media team. Getting blasted. Interesting how they don't even bother answering anybody in this post. I wonder if they just, if they understand the mess they got themselves into. <clears throat> They're being mad about this fuck up. They only care about money. Oh, shit. I think the only way to fix this is to give the exact same deal to all. I mean. New pets will lose long-term pain. I mean. Rightfully so, they've been fucking the game for a long time. Go play a fucking clone, guys. Go play a clone. <clears throat> Go fucking play a different game. While I do think it's common practice for many companies to exclude existing members. Alright, it's too much straight. Alright, that was a blast from the past. Who is this person? You know what? Are we going to see a lot of Neopets here? Ooh, part of Pay It Forward. This is going to be a lot of Neopet shit. Is a snail there somewhere? Fuck it, I'll bite. I could do without that looking weird fluid. I mean, the hard shell talk look really good, but I don't know what's going on with this meat. This meat gives me the heebie-jeebies. That's a nice dress. That's, so that was seven years ago. Mmm, vegan. I don't know about that. <laughs> Oh, that's probably why. Is this is this some like meat substitute? 
It doesn't. It doesn't look. It looks like underdone meat. But it also doesn't look like meat, like the cheese and like rank like. Like, don't get me wrong. I'd fucking eat that if I had a chance. Like, I also like the plate. It's a nice plate. What's on this cup up here? I need a cats. Yeah. Did they etch this on a glass? It's possible. That's that character from that show that I don't watch. <laughs> that crown's very specific. I'm just not a coaster person, by the way. It, like, I don't know. Like, the way people buy and use shit and, like, don't, like... All right. I mean, I like the fashion sense. We could maybe do without... We could... I thought they'd be like, hey, this is my account. Floral and C. Alright. I probably should have stopped it a while ago, but I'm trying to just end the story on here, but... <clears throat> Mom said, it's my turn with Reddit luck. What'd you get? That's a good update, or a good actual reward. Alright, that's been fun. Wild 24 hours. Maybe I'll gamble some NP between these two days because Wednesday is going to be the new AMA. Whether I respond to it on Wednesday or Thursday, I don't really know. I'm not even sure he's even actually even doing it. Let's take a quick pick or a quick. Oh, no, I didn't. But fuck, I didn't bet Food Club. Ah, shit. No. Sorry, I'm trying to find that Neil cord. All right. Price pool updates. Uh, when's this AMA happening? Merch updates. Um, wonderful weekend. Can I do merch? We'll be releasing pet pins. You think I want a fucking pin? Is that a camouflage with a stuff? Like. The only thing they could do to keep, like, fucking up the game was to be all of a sudden to have a fucking, like, fucking mega fucking pet in the game. <laughs> then just, like, delete the pet. <laughs> it's like, no. You never saw that, guys. A fucking pin. Fuck me. When, like, who's hosting the MMA? I don't even know. Alright, I just can't. Any negative comments on here or anything? It's kind of crazy that you usually get like a whole bunch of fucking like positive shit. And this is like, eh. Alright, alright. That's enough of that. Alright. Peace.